one of the trickiest things to get right when taking a shot is to get the exposure correct so you have a nice range of shadows, midtones, and highlights. Here, for example, we've got some detail in the highlights. They're looking okay, and the shadows are nice and dark in the tree, but the midtones are a little bit bland. We're not really seeing as much detail as we could. Now we can have a quick look at a histogram just to have another way of looking at the tones in the shot. So if we go to Window Histogram, very quickly you can see there's lots of shadow detail there with the graph. The midtones aren't as strong or well represented, and then we've got some nice strong highlights stretching up to the right of the histogram. So we can tweak those midtones um, by using color curves. So let's go up to Enhance and go to Adjust Color and go to adjust color curves and what we're going to do is we're going to change the contrast of the shot so we have a nice range of shadows, midtones and highlights with especially with more detail in these midtones here and there's lots of different presets here so you don't need to worry about um, sliders or changing curves manually you can start off by going to these presets for example let's go to something dramatic first of all like um, backlight that's brightening up the after version. If we go to darken highlights, you can see it's changing there again. Increased contrast blows out the highlights there in the um, brightest parts of the shot, so that's no good at all. And we're interested in brightening up the midtones, so let's go to increase midtones, and you can see as you click here, the curves are adjusting accordingly to brighten up the areas or darken the areas that you want to. You can then fine tune things by going to a slider and then just dragging that up a little bit more. If we go too far, of course, you can see it's blowing out some detail in the sky there. So let's just brighten the midtones a little bit more um, by going to around here. And you can see now there's much more detail in the midtone section. And if I bring in the histogram by clicking OK, dragging that back on again, you can see the histogram has changed now. The shadows aren't quite as dominant and powerful, um, and they're more in line with the midtones now. So that has improved the contrast of the shot, and we can see much more detail in the midtone areas here.